Evening. The state government has announced Uber will be legalised in Victoria, but passengers could be slugged an extra $2 for every trip. The levy will fund $378 million in compensation for taxi licence holders. Jade Vincent reports. For at least the next eight years, every trip in a cab or Uber will incur a $2 levy and passengers could be forced to make the gold coin donation to the taxi industry. There will be a complete level playing field where cabs as we know them will be able to compete. In establishing a single commercial passenger industry, the state government will deregulate taxi fares, legalise ride sharing services like Uber and scrap existing taxi licences. It is about giving passengers greater choice. $378 million will be made available to compensate licence holders. A separate $75 million fairness fund will assist drivers hit hard by the changes and improve access for passengers with a disability. If you're in financial hardship, we will be there for you and we will provide support and assistance. Uber has called on the government to provide a justification for the proposed operator levy, but wouldn't reveal whether it would be passing it on to customers. Anything that makes transport more expensive is a bad thing for consumers. The $2 fee is a large one by all standards. I think the $2 is excessive. You know, it's a tax on each and every trip. I don't think an additional fee is fair at all. No, that's expensive enough as it is already. Licence holders will be handed $100,000 to buy back their first licence and $50,000 for the second, all to be paid out over eight years. Some taxi drivers say it's not enough. I don't think it's worth it. If they gave him a compensation, what about our work? We're ready to compete, but we need a level playing field. And we're live now to Jade in the city. Jade, what standards will drivers now have to meet? Good evening, Pete. Well, in, to ensure passenger safety under these new reforms, all drivers, so cabbies and Uber drivers, will have to pass police and medical checks. Now, Uber drivers will actually be able to queue in cab ranks like this one to pick up passengers, but they'll have to meet stringent re requirements, such as installing security cameras and fare meters in, the, in their cars. But all of these changes are still a fair way off. The state government hopes to introduce legislation to legalise Uber by the end of this year, and that $2 trip levy won't be implemented until 2018. Pete? Okay.